can't be fog at this level. That ship seems to be disappearing. Control tube is burst. You take a few minutes to replace it. Dr. Ewer, it's all right, sir. We're safely through them. There she is, straight ahead. All squadrons converge on our position and attack a hidden city ship. Look, it's another squadron. Dr. Ewer. I've been trying to bomb it, but the main tube has burst. Look, they shot away the control rockets. Wilma, better dump your rockets. I'll try to make a forced landing. We're gonna crash. Stand clear. Crashed in mid-air, Doctor. Captain Rankin. Captain Rankin. Yes, sir. Hold your squadron ready to take off at a moment's notice. Yes, sir. Look, if they come through that crash, there's no chance for them now. Three of Kane's ships are coming in for a landing. ready to take off, sir. Take off immediately. Your flight direction is roughly north or west. Your exact map coordinates will be radioed to you. Very well, sir. Flight formation B, north by west. We'll pick up map coordinates by radio. wanted to get his hands on this Buck Rogers for a long time. Put them both in my ship. That's one hidden city ship we won't have to fight anymore. strategy. Buck Rogers has been brought here a prisoner. Bring him in. What have you done with Lieutenant Deering? We are not here to discuss her. You are the one we are interested in. Rogers, you have been the source of considerable annoyance to me. 
That's all over now. You may even be of some help to us if you place any real value on your life. A uh, bargain, eh, Kane? What is it? Lead one of my combat squadrons to the secret entrance of the hidden city. <laughs> do you really believe Dr. Hewer's men would do that? Get one of the amnesia helmets. What good will it do to put that helmet on him? That only robs him of his memory and his will. We can't learn anything that way. They'll get you for this, Kent. Put it on him. Polish my boot. Nothing left at the ship, sir, except a few steel plates, all buckled and twisted with the flames. We could hardly have expected anything else. We shall miss those two, both as friends and as soldiers. As long as Rogers was alive, I believe eventually we could have defeated Killer Kane and his outlaws. Fortunately, his last act was to secure us the support of the men on the planet Saturn. What makes you all so sure that Buck and... Buck and Wilmer are dead? You wouldn't ask that, buddy. If you could have seen their ship. Well, they might have escaped with their degravity belts. They didn't have time for that. I saw the crash through the televi. But Kane's ships landed. They might have taken them as prisoners. Oh, I just know they're not dead. If Kane has captured them, their death will be just as certain and even more brutal. But Kane wouldn't kill them, sir. I know. I was with him on Saturn. I. Dr. Ewer, could your pastoscope bring back a scene that happened on another planet? Well, yes, I... I believe we could pick it up if it happened recently. Then please try to bring back the scene where Kane's men captured Buck on Saturn. I'm sure it'll prove to you, sir, why Buck is so much more valuable to Kane alive than he is dead. Very well, but it'll only be an experiment. We may not be able to recreate a scene that happened on another planet at all. Of course, the first thing is to blot out the present from our vision. The next is to coordinate the time with the distance to Saturn. And if we can find the exact point of convergence, we... That's it, Saturn. It's right near where our ship was forced down. Nice going, buddy. Done like a major. How many of you on the loose around here? How many? Four of us. Four, huh? Wilma. Wilma, keep him covered. Come on, on your feet, sir. Come along, buddy. We've got a date for another surprise party. Take it easy. 
Get up on your feet. Get him back around out of sight. Stop where you are. Hand me that gun. Give it to me. There's nothing else you can do, woman. All right, then. Let's get them back to the spaceship. There, you see what I mean, sir? But it still doesn't give us reason to believe Buck and Wilmer escaped from the ship, buddy. I don't care what any of you say. I know Buck is still alive. I just know it. You may report back to your commander, Captain Rankin. Yes. Captain Rankin, you don't think Buck is dead, do you, sir? Buddy? I don't know what to think. Well, then why not find out, sir? Find out? How? Well, fly me over to Killer Kane City and don't be looking when I bail out. My buddy, Marshal Craig, would never permit such a thing. Well, he needn't know, sir. Oh. oh, Buck Rogers wouldn't run out on us if we were in trouble, would he? No, I... I suppose he wouldn't. Well, then we can't run out on him, can we? Might mean a court-martial. But we can't desert him as long as there's a chance. Come on, bud. What, another one from Hidden City? One of the leaders, Buck Rogers. Looks like he might have been a pretty good man when he was a man. I got just the job for him. All right, you. Get over there. better about this, buddy, if I were going with you. Oh, dazed a kid, I could probably get away with a lot more stuff than a couple of us could. Maybe you're right. I hope so. We'll say when you're ready. All right, Lieutenant. Happy landing. Thank you, sir. Turn on the searchlight. I think I heard something. Over to the right.
bullet. Back slowly. Turn it off. You must have been mistaken.